and welcome to Meaningful Mondays with me, Rashmi Shetty, a space where I share my life lesson. And today is my masterclass on customer delight. This happened a few years ago when I had a 10-day training program with a company. I grew up in Chennai and I was super excited that I get to spend 10 days in Chennai. I called up one of my friends in Chennai and said I'll be there for 10 days and therefore we should catch up. And she was also very, very happy. And she said, okay, so where's your training? And when I told her the venue, she's like, oh my God, this is like 15 minutes walk from my house. I think you should come and stay here and we'd have a good time. I was excited as much as she was. I thought nothing like staying with an old school friend and catching up with all that life had given both of us. And I agreed instantly. When I left for Chennai, I was excited about the assignment of 10 days and also the fact that my evenings are going to be that much more enjoyable because I'm going to catch up with an old school friend. Little realizing that this trip had a life lesson for me. I did Chennai the day one I went for the train and uh, with all the formalities done by the time I left the venue it was around 6, 6.15 and dusk time. The sun was just setting. It was still bright, but the sun was setting. And if you have been to Chennai, you notice that every street ends with a temple. So, so was my friend's house. And when I was nearing the house, I saw this temple and outside the temple, a lot of hawkers selling flowers. So I usually prefer going to senior citizens because I love talking to them and also in some way helping them by buying whatever they are selling. I saw this lady who, uh, when our eyes met, had one of the most divine smiles I've seen and went up to her and started noticing uh, the different jasmine she had. And there's one particular jasmine which in Tamil we call Jadimal and in Kannada it's called as Jajimali. Very fragrant seasonal jasmine. I love it. So when I saw that with her, I thought, okay, let me pick it up. So I spoke to her in Tamil, local language, and asked her the price of it and spoke to her many other things because I loved the way she was talking. So I asked her about her youth, about her childhood, about her children. She asked about mine. We had a long conversation and then I told her, okay, give me all the jasmine that you're having. So she smiled, she opened a cover and she put the jasmine in and along with that she put a few loose roses which we normally buy in grams. She just was putting it in. And I was surprised because I had not spoken to her about needing those roses. So I said, what is that? I didn't ask for it. So she smiled and she said, Illama Andu. So right there, she completely threw me off here. Because Andu in Tamil is one of the purest forms of affection that you have that between a parent and a child, between spouses, between friends, where it's unconditional and absolutely pure. I right there got the life lesson on customer delight. It was a wow for me. And from then on for the remaining nine days, I would buy flowers, even though I didn't need it, I would buy it if she was seated there. And I understood just by being your true, honest self, how beautifully you can connect with people. What she taught me was a lesson on attitude of connection. You don't have to have fancy degrees from great colleges, but if you are completely in a space of self-awareness and you're speaking with authenticity, you will connect with anyone at a human level. 